Hello kitty fans! As you might know by now, I live in the Netherlands and that's not a particularly very good country to live in when you collect Hello Kitty. Don't get me wrong, I love it here, but there's just so little Hello Kitty. It's just uh, toys, a few toys and stuff for little kids. And But sometimes you can find some nice things, but most of my Hello Kitty goodies I get abroad online or when we go on vacation. But I do have some typical Dutch Hello Kitty items. And when I started gathering all my stuff for this video, I found out I've got actually quite a lot. I'm starting off with my first and personal favorite Hello Kitty item. It's uh, my Dutch Hello Kitty plush. And she's from the city of Leiden. And she's got typical Dutch clothing. And she's even got the clothing they wore in Leiden uh, a few hundred years ago. Or maybe not a few hundred, but a while ago. And... She's got a little tulip and she's got wooden shoes. Look at them. I think they're so adorable. And she's got this nice tag on it. And it's a Dutch Hello Kitty standing in front of Dutch houses. And I really love this. And this is my profile picture, as you might have seen. Uh, she's my favorite Hello Kitty. And here's the flyer you got at the Siebold house where they had the exhibition. And there she is again. And she's so cute. So when I was there, I also bought this mug and I'm not using this one. This is for my collection, but I wish I bought two because I would love to drink out of this. But no, this is going in my collection. And I've also got some stuff that looks Dutch, but really isn't. Um, like this one, it looks like Delft's blue. And if you look close, it's a Hello Kitty sitting in a landscape that's really not Dutch. But uh, I thought I'd show it to you because it really looks Dutch. And I've also got a cup, a saucer, and it's just so adorable, but nothing to do with Holland, but still very cute. And then I've got this cute little tea set, and it's uh, pink porcelain, and it's not really Dutch, but they want to make it look a bit Dutch. So um, it's really cute. And of course, I just had to buy it. I'm going to leave it in here because it looks really cute. And from the same manufacturer, I've got this. It's a placemat. And there are markers with it. I'll just take a placemat out. Actually, there are two different ones. It's a blue placemat. Can you see that? <laughs> and it's so adorable. Okay, and there's uh, also a red placemat. It looks really cute. And you can color it in whilst you eat. Uh, but I don't do that anymore. Not fast I eat anyway. I've also got these little books. They're so adorable. They're for making uh, your own 3D cards. And I've sent some to my Hello Kitty friends in America. And um, well, they've got cute little Dutch um, Hello Kitties in there. I'll just show you a page. So you can cut it out in steps and then glue it together again with little foam tape. And you got these lovely cards you can make with this one. And I've got this one, and you can make these cards. And I've got another one. There were three of them with these cards, and I still have to make lots of them. Um, I'm more of a rubber stamper, so I don't do this very much, but it's so cute. What else have I got? I've got this cute thing. It's a knicker spell, and it's a marble um, game. I think uh, this is not a really typical Dutch marble game. It's just um, looks Dutch with that Dutch houses. You have to put this uh, far away and then roll the marbles and then get them into the houses, into the doors. And there's got there's points on there. And it's really cute because it looks really Dutch with the tulips and the little houses. Um, another thing I have, oh, it's from the same, same factory. Um, it's an apron for children when they uh, use paint or other creepy stuff that can get on their clothes. Um, I'm not taking this out of the package because it's so neatly folded and uh, I think it's just cute. It's got again the tulips and it looks like a little tile. So what else have I got? I've got this one. We celebrate uh, Sinterklaas, which is uh, a lot like Santa Claus. Actually Santa Claus comes from our Sinterklaas and he comes to Holland and we celebrate his birthday on the 5th of December. And this is a t-shirt that says, I'll show you this side better. 
it says this year i've been naughty or nice you can take your pick and um it says hello kitty sinterklaas so that's typical dutch i love this <laughs> this is so cute another typical dutch thing is queen's day we celebrate the birthday of our queen on the 30th of april doesn't matter when her birthday is it's on the 30th of april and they made little t-shirts a few years ago and that was in 2013 and that was i think our last queen's day because of course now we have a king so it's king's day it's getting a bit i have to get used to that because it's been queen's day all my life but now it's king's day but this one is still from queen's day and it's hello kitty with a crown and it says hello holland and uh the tag is cute it says queen's day hello kitty and i really love this when i saw this i just went berserk because they never have anything hello kitty in the netherlands t-shirts to wear and suddenly there they were two of them and this one also says queen's day and it says uh what does it say orange diva orange diva and that was so cute and i was really blown away when i found out they had t-shirts for adults they never have t-shirts for adults in the netherlands so that was so great it says feeling like the queen for the day and it's dutch majestic it says over here and it's so great unfortunately not, not in my size but still i've got one and that's this one and she just has the crown on there and um yeah i really love this so that was so great when i found that and then there was more they also had this you can put put on your coat or your t-shirt or whatever it says crown princess which means crown princess um succeeder for the throne <laughs> i don't know how you say that first in line <laughs> and um they also had caps and this one says hello kitty holland and there she is with the orange crown and the dutch flag and that was so great and another one again with a crown and a flag and the queen's day tag on it so i was so happy when i found this i was just ah, going mad in the store people were staring at me <laughs> and um what's this this year uh the next year 2014 when we had a king it was king's day and they had this look at it it's a cute little tutu and it's orange and it's got an orange bow with hello kitty on it and i thought that was so great uh Luckily, they didn't have it in my size this time, <clears throat> but that was so cute. And again, t-shirts. And uh, this year uh, they do have t-shirts, but the same as this one. So um, this one says uh, "Crown Princess" again, and that means crown princess. And uh, well, this one doesn't have a Queen's Day tag; it just has a Hello Kitty tag. <laughs> and this one is also so cute. It says "Princess van Oranje." princess of orange and look at it it's hello kitty dressed up as amalia and amalia is our crown princess so isn't that adorable <laughs> so having your own hello kitty t-shirt that must be great i don't know if she's a fan of hello kitty but anyways there are also socks to go with it and they're so adorable they're so cute look here she's got a little crown and again only for children but um great for my collection I would have wore these actually <laughs> but uh, not in my size and then they also had these and um, this one again says crown princess and it's gold on the inside and there's a new tag it only says hello kitty <laughs> no queen king's day you don't want to say queen's day no king's day and um again princess van oranje princess of orange and i think i even fit these i do i look great that's a thumbnail for you there <laughs> okay <clears throat> well so really cute and really dutch really orange <laughs> and uh well that's about it um some uh queen's day stuff uh sorry king's day stuff i think by the time i get that right amalia will be queen so i have to get used to that again plus all my um typical dutch hello kitty stuff so that was quite a lot uh a few really dutch cute little kitty uh, items and a lot of hello kitty queen's day items and king's day items and i hope they do more of this because it's really so adorable and why shouldn't we have hello kitty in the netherlands there are lots of fans 
come on Sanrio, come to Europe. We don't even have a Sanrio website in Europe. Oh, come on Sanrio, why just in America? I see so much goodies on the American website that I really want, but they don't even ship to Europe. So um, I think it's time by now. So from one of Holland's biggest Hello Kitty fans, I want to give you all a big Hello Kitty hug. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And please subscribe to see more of these videos. And as we say here in Holland, doeg! Bye!